Hi YouTube. Um, I'm going to do a little video on my chickens and my rabbits. But the main reason I'm doing this is one of my buddies on YouTube has been helping me with the whole rabbit thing. And um, anyway, I have uh, had a couple questions for him and he needs to see a video. These two girls were the first ones somebody gave me, one of my students gave me, because she didn't want the responsibility. And so um, I took them on. They're not that friendly. I mean, they're okay once you get a hold of them and stuff. Um, but they're, they just hadn't been handled a whole lot. So they're both those sisters. Anyway, um, <clears throat> they're all happy and healthy. And, well, these are my chickens. And we're going to try to get them better cages. Again, these were given to us. <clears throat> There's a really nice mama. Oh, and then my chickens are in here. Look at that nice mama and her baby. They cute. Oh, gee. That little guy, as far as I can tell, that's a little buck right here. Yeah, and that's such a nice mama. And there's uh, a little white one in the back, and there's another little white one. I think they're females, but I could be wrong. I'm just... Uh, I'll check them again. They're not... I, she wasn't sure exactly how old they were, but I think they're right at four weeks. Just very friendly and stuff. And um, They actually are in my chicken's yard, and the chickens get under there and eat all the scrap broccoli that falls through. And, yeah, hi girls. I just wanted to make sure that they had um, enough sta shade. This whole um, chicken area is covered because we have hawks and all kinds of stuff. And they don't have a whole lot of room to get out of the weather. Our little coop over there. Oh, we're getting ready to paint everything. We painted our house. So we're getting ready to paint. But it's a um, little double-decker. It's got plenty of room for the girls and uh, I didn't need all the doors open and um, I can get to everything and get it cleaned out really nice and neat so and this this cage that the two black and white ones are in it actually has a divider so if you needed to divide it into two you could um, so if we breed either one of these does then we'll, uh, we can separate them now I'm going to go over to the bucks that the people gave us, and it's kind of sad, so um, I'm going to pause you for a second, and I'm going to get over there. Okay, there's the mama and the babies again, and the reason we chose this area for the chickens, or the, actually the chickens and the rabbits, is we have a nice big shade pine tree. So I don't know if we'll be able to see him very well, because he's kind of back in the corner here. Yeah, I don't know. Um, there he is. Hi, buddy. Hi. I'm going to stick the camera inside the hutch. Or the yeah, the hutch. He's all laid out, but really and truly, he is a solid mass of mats. I've never seen anything like it. If you touch him, he's all matted up. It's, and, you know, and because he's been in here laying... Um, I don't think they cleaned out his cage very often because he's pretty dirty. And so, I'm not sure if I can clip him or not. He's really hot and unhappy and so, um, and the other thing, I guess when that female got bred, they had him in with her because that's, let's see, they said that this guy was her son. And, um... When she got ready, when she started pulling hair, uh, they pulled him out of there and put him in with his father. And within a half hour, he had killed the other buck. So, he doesn't seem real cranky. I mean, I've got the camera really close. Um, let me see if I can. I don't know how I can do this. And But these are mats. It's just, it's very sad. And I, my question to my rabbit buddy was can I clip him and how would I go about that by myself <laughs> um, I mean I've I've got a friend that'll probably come over and help me I just 
knowing how uh, tender their skin is, you know, when you butcher rabbits, they, uh, their skin tears pretty easily, and I just would hate for that to happen. I have clippers because I was a horse trainer forever and had um, a Springer Spaniel I had to clip on a regular basis, so I have no problem doing that part, but I really, um, I just want to know that that would be an okay thing. I guess I could call my bet. But he asked me if I would do a little video, so I decided that I would. <clears throat> and there's the new color of our house. And we're going to have our two sheds and the chicken coop all painted up too. So, um, I hope this is the video you were looking for and I will wait for your response and your advice. Okay, if anybody else has any advice, um, I really appreciate it. And, uh, I, I really like having the rabbits and I like the idea between the rabbits and the chickens just being a little more self-reliant. That's the whole idea behind this. We get eggs every day and you know the rabbits can serve as meat later on. So anyway, I'm going to let this go and get this uploaded. Alright guys, see you next time.